Yeah, Everything look good? Hands in there? So there it goes. Okay, it's over there. So I'm looking this direction. Okay. And then, of course, someday our, our final goal is to continually develop the airplane so we have new products coming out, new models coming out year after year. People want more comfortable transportation. The Cirrus is truly the plane of tomorrow. I mean, I really feel honored to be here. I mean, I feel like I've almost been uh, part of the Cirrus family. It's an absolute delight to fly a plane like this. They're as passionate as I'm about this. It's not just the 9,000th airplane, it's the next best thing. We've got 9,000 airplanes out in the wild who are a testament to what we call the Cirrus life. When we were designing the 9,000th limited edition, we really tapped into that Cirrus life part of aircraft ownership. The Cirrus is much more than just an airplane. It's sort of a portal to adventure and experiences and connections with other people. I mean, it sounds simple, but it's the reality for a lot of our owners. We own a crane company. The Cirrus Life for my family and I, it, it buys time. The Cirrus Life is simply access to the things that I want to do, things that I can get to because of my Cirrus. Right around 2005, we started to get more feedback from our owners. They wanted more room. So Generation 5 ushered in a new era that quickly became known as the Cirrus Life era. We weren't looking for some sort of tagline. I'd almost say the tagline found us. I have heard all sorts of bucket list trip stories. We flew in a Monterey on the Bay, Idaho, Phoenix, Arizona, Beach, the Outer Banks, Bank, Mountains, Paso Robles, I flew my Cirrus to Alaska. I flew my Cirrus to the Bahamas. That's what we're going to do. We're going to fly our Cirrus. 9,000 as our series aircraft is a lot of airplanes, so it's definitely worth celebrating. We wanted the 9,000 aircraft. We wanted to hit the milestone with Cirrus. So this airplane is really a tribute to those two sides of the house. You know, the ones that are building this airplane and handcrafting this every day, and to the pilots and the owners who are flying these things with their families and their friends in support of this idea of bringing the Cirrus life to life. The skyline at sunset, which is just an unreal sight when you're flying a Cirrus. <laughs> weirdly can be every day. So when we were designing the 9,000th limited edition, we really tapped into that serious life and experiential part of aircraft ownership. And it was really inspired by a lot of the colors and experiences in the Mediterranean. So gorgeous blue water and the bright white homes and really that feeling of the salt spray, the volcanic landscape. And that's really where the design was born. Inspired by the same area, we came up with completely different ideas for how to interpret the Mediterranean onto an aircraft. The 9000 Limited Edition took inspiration from the Mediterranean in four different ways. The first one is Santorini, the second, magma, the third, lava, and the fourth, balos. So we really get to tap into the creativity of the design team, but also put it right over that design edge where it becomes just my mind. For the 9000, we wanted a bright, bold theme color, um, but we thought we'd take it in a little bit of a different direction to give customers more of a choice to really make it personal for them. Our Santorini collection features four colors inspired by the Mediterranean, Mykonos, Aegean, Ocean, and Lava Orange accents. Magma features Meteorite, Sterling, Caldera, and Lava Orange accents. Balos features Baja Blue, Caldera, Sterling, and Orange Accents. Lava features Caldera, Sterling, and of course Lava Orange. 
There's a continuous thread in those designs, which is that lava orange. Um, so they've all got this orange theme. On the interior, you see that lava color continued throughout the interior. There's a more subdued basalt interior that's more black Alcantara with hints of lava throughout the cabin. And then there's a louder, brashier interior called lava, more orange than black, a really fun, bright, bold interior, kind of to match that lava thread throughout the design. Now the Prillimans, they went all in on the unique. From the words of Paul Prilliman. I enjoy an airplane with a lot of pop and a little bit of class. My son said, dude, pick any of them. They're all sick. I would never drive an orange car. I think I could fly that orange airplane. There's no limit to what you're able to do with your Cirrus. Your only limit is really your imagination. So if this design unleashes your imagination for adventure, we've done our jobs. We hope all Cirrus owners go out and live their best Cirrus life. What an owner may not realize is that they're inspiring us in our designs. And the Cirrus 9000 is testament to that. But we also hope that you are inspired to inspire others to follow their dreams. Plane full of pilots and it's their first time in the series. What do you reckon? Beautiful. It's Everyone's fine. converted. What I want you to be reminded of is that this all started in a bar with two brothers who had a dream of flight. In its simplest form, that is the Cirrus life. It's always been the Cirrus life. And this airplane brings it all together so we can celebrate this very idea that keeps us flying. It takes a village to get to this point. Every single airplane has a lot of human touch and we've hand built 9,000 of them. I believe that if I had 20 hours in a Cirrus or if I had 10,000 hours in a Cirrus, I would believe there's no other airplane I want. And not just because the machine, but because the people that come with the machine. The Cirrus family is a wide array of people and we couldn't be here without every single one of you all the different groups around Cirrus that have helped cultivate and create the Cirrus life, thank you. And I am wildly optimistic about where Cirrus Aircraft is going and all of the things that we are ready to celebrate with our customers and our employees.